Hello and welcome to Trust News Summary. I'm Dashan Husseina Usman. The news in brief. Passengers have been assured of their security as the Abuja Kaduna train service resumes operations on Monday. Trust TV's Noel Sampson reports that the train departed Idu train station at 9.45 a.m. for Kaduna for the first time in more than 250 days. Passengers expressed joy as operations began, saying they have waited so long for the operations to resume. The gunmen who were arrested at the MENA residence of Mohammed Sani Musa, the All Progressives Congress Senator representing Niger East Senatorial District in the National Assembly, have told the police that they were sent to kidnap the lawmaker. Niger State Police Command's Public Relations Officer, DSP Wasiu Abiodun, who confirmed this in a statement on Monday, said they ransacked the residence under the pretext of the purported search execution. The People's Democratic Party Presidential Campaign Council has announced former Speaker of the House of Representatives, Yakubu Dogara, as member with immediate effect. The Director General of Campaign Council, Aminu Tomwal, in a statement on Sunday, said Dogara's appointment is part of continuous effect in joining hands with presidential candidate Atiku Abubakar to recover Nigeria. And finally, a landslide engulfed a road Sunday in Colombia, killing three people and leaving some 20 trapped in the mud. Authorities say crews are searching for people riding on a bus and a motorcycle that were caught up in the accident in a remote area of a municipality called Pueblo Rico in northwest Colombia. The bus had set out from the city of Cali with 25 passengers. And that's it on Trust News Summary. Don't forget to follow us across all our social media platforms. I'm Dashan Husseina Usman. Thanks for watching.